Both these guys won Flow Nationals. Serrano two years ago when it was Folk. Mendez this year when it was free. And both these guys had... I mean, this bracket was ridiculous. So both of these guys had a really tough road getting here and came through with flying colors. Deep shot by Serrano. They're going to score that four. No, they're not going to score the four. They're going to go two and two and two. Two and two and one and two. I believe. Oh no, four, four, two, one. Yeah, that makes more sense. Five, two lead after a minute. Body lock for Mendez, big throw. That's a five. And he has Serrato in trouble. He has a long time to work for this fall. He has that arm cinched. Serrano able to get out. But now before Mendez takes the lead, what technique on that? 7-5. What about? Great first period, 7-5 at the break. Mendez had a big win over Fargo runner-up Mick Burnett. Serrano also beat a Fargo runner-up. There were eight level twos in this bracket. One of them wasn't Mendez. Mendez is a level three. Oh, no, yeah, there was 11 level twos or threes. Just tremendous depth at this bracket. And we're down to our final four. Mendez holding the 7 5 lead thanks to a big five point play. Winner here will get. The winner of our other semi, Josh Edmond, which is a who is a Fargo you, champ, you, and Albert you, Ferrari, who is the runner-up, who was the runner-up last year here. Into a body lock again for Mendez, and again it's trapped. The Serrano counters with a lat drop, and now he has Mendez in all kinds of trouble. And Mendez somehow able to roll all the way through. Awarded just a two for Serrano. So we're tied up. Mendez will have criteria with that five. Shot from outside, Mendez trying to turn the corner. Twenty seconds. Fifteen. I wonder if Serrano knows he has to score. Eleven seconds on the restart. And Mendez blocks off and Jesse Mendez is gonna win a wild one. Seven seven and on to the finals.